Hey guys and welcome to the lowest recoil build for the AKM and the AKMN. They are identical apart from this one has a dovetail mount. The entire build is going to be based off the AKM that you get from tier 2 from Prepper. This is the lowest recoil build. Let's get straight into this. Let's head over to Skia tier 2. We're going to need to get ourselves the RK3 pistol grip. As well as the Zenit RP1 charge handle. Then we need to head over to tier 4. We need to get ourselves the Lantec Dracon 762 muzzle brake. As well as the Zenit RK2 pistol grip. As well as the Fab Defense PDC dust cover for the AK74. Now we need to head over to Peacekeeper. We need to go to tier 4. And we need to get ourselves the Zukov S for the AK. Now, over to Mechanic Tier 3. We need to get ourselves the Strike Industries Key Mod 6 inch guide. Then, over to Tier 4. Get ourselves the Viltor CMRD uh, Key Mod. And, in my opinion, the best sight in the game because of the accuracy bonus of 3%. Okay, now let's put everything together. And this is the lowest recoil build for the AKM and the AKMN. Okay, so we're inside the hideout. That's full auto. That recoil really isn't that bad, actually. Apart from the initial kick on this gun, this is actually quite a easily controlled recoil. So guys, hopefully you found this guide useful. If you whack this in with BP, this thing is going to be an absolute killer. Guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.